their desk at work, suddenly they've taken ill and they've had to clock off from work for the day and head down to watch. Yeah, they are definitely coming here and watching and cheering for especially the Czech paddlers. Martin Dugut from Switzerland had a great uh, race last week, made the final, finished seventh mm. in a very competitive men's <coughs> K1 nice. final. On a, <coughs> pardon me, on a very difficult course. Yeah, he's a very dynamic paddler, very light on the water, and so far looking very nice, looking good. Great combination there from Martin Dugut, and yeah. nice and Look at that, nice very fast, good. Yeah. yeah. So we are again, I need to emphasize, Vic Prindes is actually through with a gate touch, so it can be done. Yeah, it, in the in the women's semi-final it was one with touch. One athlete only, yeah, and it so was maybe the Olympic gold medal. So. <laughs> <laughs> and Vic Prindes is a world champion, so, so there you go. That's, yeah. You can get away with it if you're a certain quality yeah. of paddler, of which Martin Dugood, by the way, is of that quality. We know he's, he's good enough, but he hasn't got a touch yet, he's clean, so let's see if he can... He's clean and looking uh, sharp on the water, get a bit stuck there, so he needs, if he wants to make a final, he needs to pull out his A game now in the last couple yep. of gates. David Laurent from Spain is the one watching. Yeah. He is the one at the moment teetering on the edge with a 94.3. Here we go, here we go. Yes. Very tight, I think. I think he's going to be close to that 94.3 he needs to go under. Yeah, I think he's he going to do it. it. Yeah. Well, that's a good run. Martin Dugan, well. two weeks in a row. Yeah. What he says, how did that happen? <laughs> yeah. I don't believe it. <laughs>